you were uh, uh, hunted like wild game throughout the country on the highways and in the towns and cities to beat and kill. They provoked you to get a chance to have an excuse for beating and killing you. This is known. All over the world and all eyes is on this. Treatment of the so-called Negro here in America by the white man. But yet, they would like that you believe that I am the worst enemy that ever appeared among you. They do everything to keep you from believing the truth of them. They have practically a hundred percent of our black preachers following them through and under fear that they may lose their respect or rather lose their places as preachers or ministers under their religious therapy. They, I just repeat, under their religious setup, it was not God who set up their religion. They set it up themselves, as they plainly teach you in the history of the setting up of their religion, Christianity. They want you to hate truth. They want you to follow them in falsehood. They want you to remain with them, though they hate you and despise you. And that's not like you nor your color. Then they come to you and say to you, Elijah hates us. And he teaches hatred. I want you to remember, my friend, that they could have been green color. They could have been blue color. But if their nature, their characteristics, had been good. We can't not say about that color. It could have been whatever it made. If they were good, that's okay with the righteous. We will treat them and would they would have been treated as the righteous. Regardless of what color they would have been made in. If they were good, we would look forward to them as a race of good people. And they would be given that credit and the history. But the white race don't have nothing in the history that teaches that they are good or ever was good. From the creation of them unto this very hour, the history and even the prophesy of the prophets teaches us that they are an evil hateful and murderous, proud people from their very beginning and to their ending. And it's the people that God has said through the mouth of his prophets that they, <laughs> that, pardon me, that he will destroy on the day of resurrection of the dead. And that cannot be a good people that so much prophesied, made in both the Bible and the Holy One, 